Hey guys, in this video I'm going to show you how to grow your very own bell peppers at home. This is an excellent way for you to reduce your expenses at the grocery store, grow your own bell peppers. It's real simple, so here we go. So for starters, I got a, the inside of a bell pepper. Guess what? It's full of seeds. We can take these seeds and plant them and, you know, maybe about 70% of the time they're going to work. So that's pretty good considering there's probably 70 seeds there. So maybe if there's 100, 70 would work. No problem. All right. Anyway, let's continue on. You're going to need a little cup. We're going to put some dirt in here. Now, for the purposes of this video, I'm only planting one seed just to show you how to do it. You can plant many more seeds than that if you want. For example, it's excellent to use an egg carton. You can see here I've got six sprouts. Some of them look a little weak, so really we're about a 50% germination rate. These are bell peppers that I planted one month ago to the date of this video recording. So depending on when you're watching it, it could be a little off, but figure it's about 30 days from when this video is being posted online. So you'll have to check the date. But anyway, uh, that's that. So this two of them look really good. Some are sad, but you can plant them in an egg carton. That works well and go from there. But again, for the purposes of this video, one right here. So put some soil in the bottom of the cup. Now we don't have a handy dandy packet to kind of tell us the details about this plant, but from my experience, the days to germination where you first see that sprout is about 14 or 15. And then, like I said, those plants there were a month old and they were still just starting to come up. So figure in about 45 days, you should have some pretty good sprouts. So we've got the seed there. It's that little white speck in the middle of the cup. Now we want to plant these about a quarter of an inch deep. So we're going to put a little more on the top and peppers, they seem to need more water than other, than the other plants or the other seeds that I've started. So we're going to give it a good, good soaking so that it's nice and cozy in its bed of soil. We're going to put some saran wrap on the top because this is gonna turn this into a little incubation chamber. We put this in the sunlight, we'll put a rubber band around it to keep it on there, poke a couple holes in the top to allow it to breathe a little, and that's gonna be nice and warm. That soil's gonna heat up, it's gonna encourage that seed to sprout, and away we go. Also, it's important, write the date on the bottom of your cup, so you can check back and say, oh, it's been 15 days, or it's been 30 days, and if in 30 days you don't see anything sprouting, probably dud seed, dump it, start another one. That's why it's important that if you really want some peppers, plant all of these seeds. Hopefully you get peppers on half the plants and away you go. So I really hope you enjoyed this video because that is it. That is how to start your own pepper plants from seed and then move them outside Pay attention to the weather in your area to know when to plant them outside as well. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Please consider liking it and sharing it to help others. And I hope you subscribe to the channel to stay tuned to future videos.